Sean from Bankrupt Society here and today is a pretty exciting day. So I'm coming at you from Tokyo right now, I'm just in my hotel room here and um, today we are off to Hakone, it's a series of twisty roads near Mount Fuji um, and uh, we're going to drive some cars out there today. The company is called fun to drive and they offer pretty much guided tours around the area and we all get to choose our own cars and pretty much have it just to have a day out driving through the mountain roads out there. So that's what we're doing today. Weather should be pretty good too. Weather should hopefully hold out, but I'm really excited. I'm really keen and keen to show the adventure with you guys. So I will see you out there. <laughs> So I managed to miss my second bus. So I had to walk about, oh, it's not too bad. About 23 minutes, but looks like we finally made it. Here it is. We have Akuma no Zeddo. A few other cars here as well. RX-7, NSX, Supra. So we're sticking with the Toyota theme for this trip and this will be my car. So this is Takumi Fujiwara's A86. Full replica. Ride seat. No power steering, so it's gonna be interesting. See back in my day! But yeah. Super keen to have a drive in this. This is gonna be insane. It's gonna be so fun. That's just some of the scenery around here as well. Very cool car. So, so yeah, this will be my whip. Have a couple other cars here too. Lotus Elise, perfect for Torge runs. And then we have Akuma no Zeddo from the anime. One gun midnight. This one's RB25 swapped. So cool, man. And then other cars FDRX7, it's Keske. Keske's RX7 from Initial D, and SX. 34 GTR, Supra, R35, WRX, back there. That's the lineup. So this is the crew here. And a couple of people who had payment struggles, but they joined us after there, after us, so there they are there. We just stopped over for lunch right now. Too many clouds to see too much, but we're at a view cafe thing. And this is the place. So far the drive has been really fun. We're not allowed to record video record during the drive, unfortunately. But I can tell you a bit about this car though. It's um, no power steering, it's just manual everything so analog but it's just so fun i've never driven a car without power steering before so it is a learning experience but either way it's fun last thing i want to do is bin this anyway off to the next stop we'll go soon <laughs> Can't afford any of these cars? Stopped at a 7 Eleven just for a bit of a break and some food. Got me some ice cream and some copis soda, not cow piss, cow piss. Anyway, but uh, we just ran the uh, Hakone Tan bike just before this and then just the coastal road. And man, boy, was it fun! I was behind the RX7, a bit of the initial D gang here, 
but once I got used to this car, it's just, yeah, I could throw it around a little bit. It's very fun, very fun car. Anyway, here's where we are right now. And onwards. Just a quick stopover. Just doing some engine checks. But that cafe looks awfully familiar. Very famous cafe from Initial D on the top of the hill. In uh, you can see this in stage five of Initial D. But here it is. It's a real place. It's an actual place. <laughs> scenery is quite something as well. Look at that man. The sun's finally come out after the entire day. So another circle around to all the cars. We just had a mad run through some really narrow twisties. And the 86 is just such a beautiful car to handle. So good. Mate, anyway, on to the next destination. Righto, so that's the day done. So all I was about a five hour drive and um, I'm perched. <laughs> I only just got back to my hotel room and yeah, but oh man, what a day to remember this was. And um, yeah, like I said before, it was my first time driving a car with no power steering. And you know, by the end of the day, it just, it it felt amazing. The, the whole car was just so, so analog and really old school and I just loved every bit of it. You know, you heard all kinds of squeaking from different areas. Um, you can hear every nut and bolt, you can hear timing belt, but that's just an old car for you. And um, I wouldn't have it any other way. So huge shout out to Fun to Drive uh, for an awesome, amazing experience. And um, look, maybe when I come back to Japan next, I'll come again and uh, she's a different car, hopefully 32 GTR. <laughs> um, but either way, if you haven't done it already, I highly, highly, highly recommend it. It's um, it's something else. It's otherworldly. You just got to make sure you don't bin the car. If you haven't seen our videos, um, catch them on our channel. Make sure you like and subscribe and all that kind of stuff. And I'll see you in the next video. Over now. <laughs>